Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we're playing Orgul in Project 1999. I'm in Ishkarana killing Squire Wembley, who is a level 20 paladin. Definitely want to go ahead and get him feared as soon as possible because he is a caster and can wreck your face if you um, if you just snare him first. I usually put my pet on him as soon as he spawns. I actually even put my pet to actually sit where he spawns just so that he's engaged as soon as possible to keep him from buffing himself. Now, I talked to a necromancer before I did this camp. Um, actually, a few days before I did it. Xylas. Um, X-Y-L-A-S. I believe I am saying his name correctly. And he actually told me about fearing before he actually start. Just because of the fact uh, he will do some damage. You saw that he cast it on my pet just a moment ago. And he took him down to around half. So definitely don't want to mess with that. Keep him feared as often as possible. And he spawns every six minutes. So it's a really quick spawn. If you have enough mana, you can run over to the Craig Spiders and kill them. After that, I went up to High Hold and I got in a group with a Bard and a Monk who both knew their job really well. Um, with him, he was actually keeping the mana song up and the heal song, so that's double my mana output um, with a uh, Lich casted on myself. We were able to stay here for a while. I actually stayed after they had left and was able to get level 23 that night. And while I could have got Orc Scalps, I ended up passing on them. And I should not have because they are worth five plat apiece. And in my mindset, it was, you're not going to ever have the faction tournament. If I got the faction, by the time I got the faction, I'd be leaving or coming back here to kill the guards. So it, it would be pointless. But in hindsight, when people started coming around asking to buy them for five plat apiece, I kind of was annoyed that I didn't go ahead and loot them. So definitely loot the, the um, scalps. You're smarter than me, so you already know that. So I stayed here, like I said, until level 23. At that point, they did start turning a little green as far as experience goes. I was able to pick up a Sherlock pack as well as a shiny brass idol, I think is what it was called. So it was, um, it was definitely worth coming here. After this, I went to the hole in which everybody goes to, Mistmoor. Yes, the place that you stay from usually around level 20 to... 35 or plus you can come back and you can stay here to 40 if you wanted to but why <laughs> so this group was uh rather interesting it was two rogues two necromancers a warrior and a wizard the other necromancer and myself were the healers and while that is kind of funny because you can definitely see everybody's health as it goes, um, <laughs> we were we were definitely just keeping people above average as far as their health goes. So I did go ahead and hit level 24 here. And what I ended up doing was stayed a little bit longer just so I could get my buffer and then went ahead and headed back to Nuriak to get spells and as you can see here I'm doing my research to get my level 24 pet and my level 24 pet buff. So just to close out I do have some pictures on the outro that are just people that I've seen as I've wandered through the world. Some have it's only two pictures actually one is just a person that has a really funny name and the other is a couple that are wearing the exact same kind of armor. I just thought it was pretty cool. Anyway, guys, check that out. Thank you so much for watching. This is Cypher Deck. I hope you have a great day, a great night, and a great week. Go ahead and like if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And leave comments if you liked it or not in the comments below. Thank you again. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out.